Most of you are probably aware of ransomware as a service. But as in every industry, sometimes the service is really, really crappy. Today, we're taking a look at a ransomware builder that is all bark and no bite. Let me just check to make sure, yep. So the sample we have here claims to create a custom ransomware. Let's see what it does. So as soon as we execute it, as you can see, it says it's from greyhatforum.org. Now you can set in your Bitcoin address, the amount you want to charge over here. Um, so let's just say our Bitcoin address is this. I mean, that's totally a legit address, of course. And I want to charge people a thousand Bitcoin. I mean, we're making this great ransomware with a lot of sophistication. So we expect a similarly high payment. And as for the encryption key, um, it's not like I'm smart enough to figure one by myself. So I'm just going to hit this button over here that says generate. There we go. And now all we have to do is click on compile. And once we do that, we get to set the target directory and we get to call our ransomware something. So let's call it deadliest ransomware ever. That'll scare them. Yay, so our ransomware's ready to deliver payments to our bank account for free, ruin people's lives, and make me rich. Let's go ahead and run it and test to make sure it works. And boom, as you can see, your files have been encrypted, right? But then it says, all files have been infected. So wait a minute, did you encrypt my files or infect them? Then it says, get decrypt your files in four steps. Huh, go to... Buy bitcoins, pay 1000 bitcoins to the bitcoin address below. Once confirmed, your files will be decrypted. And you can enjoy your computer. If you try to close this process or shut down the computer, your files will be deleted forever and can't be recovered. Notice the exclamation marks. Only way to recover your files is to pay 1000 BTC or maybe just buy another computer. Let's go ahead and uh, restart the computer anyway, because uh, I'm clearly an idiot, uh, and this is the, totally the correct spelling for process. So uh, I'm, I'm probably going to lose all my files. We're logging back in. That's a surprise. I thought, oh no, look what's happened to my desktop. Oh no, what's happened to my files? Wait, they're still there. Instead of just 10 files, now I have a gazillion files. This ransomware actually does the opposite of what it says. It's like you had data on this computer and now that data is encrypted, it's destroyed, you cannot get to it. But instead, it's given me all these other wonderful files that I never had to begin with. Thank you so much, ransomware. You know what? I'm going to pay that 1000 BTC just to show my gratitude. Look at our desktop. We have all these beautiful files in here. So instead of taking away what files I had, it actually gave me a lot more. See, I mean, not all ransomware's bad. You can create nice ransomware. No, but seriously, don't, don't fall for this kind of crap, please. The thing is, a lot of people in this industry are just terrible wannabes who create crap like this. Some of them are going to be directed towards uh, people who are not that tech savvy and who might just get confused and pay a small amount of money before they even figure things out. So don't be that kind of person. This is Leo from the PC Security Channel. Don't forget to subscribe. And as I always say, stay informed, stay secure.